bunch of them. Oh, fuck! <laughs> You do in the kitchen, Lyra. Guess what you do? You're busy working. You're moving oh, things. Yes. Oh, I'm like super speedy in the kitchen. Can I ask you a question? Sure. Now, my grandmother's motto was "clean as you go." Are uh -huh. you a clean cook? Do you clean as you go, or do you cook everything and then clean afterwards? I clean as I go to a certain extent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I, I don't. Yeah. <laughs> You're the big like explosion kitchen mess person. If you, if you came into my kitchen after I cooked, uh -huh. I would be embarrassed. Oh my gosh. I'm like a chronic multitasker. So if I'm like, oh, this is cooking, I'm going to be cleaning over here doing something, getting yeah. ready for the next thing. Yeah. Well, Lyra, our jerk chicken is cooking. And can I tell you, every time mm. I take a breath in, I want to cough just because the seasonings are so yeah. strong. Yeah, don't get your nose so close, Jerry. I'm going to pull that to the camera. Yeah, don't get too close. <laughs> you may want to wear a little mask when you're preparing this. <laughs> Because literally, the seasoning is amazing. Like, it's going to taste great. Oh, I know. The aroma, it's, it it's just so good. <laughs> and it's browning up really nice and getting crusty on the underside. It's gorgeous. So, Lyra, it's set, I believe, four to five minutes on one side and then mm -hmm. flip it. I honestly have not been timing it, so I don't know if we need to flip it yet or not. I think it's time to flip. Flip it? I okay. really do. Everyone, we're going to be flipping the chicken. I added just a little. Oh, look at that. Yeah. To me, when I think of jerk gorgeous. chicken, I think of the blackened mm -hmm. crust on it. Yeah, it, when you do it, it looks a lot similar. Of course, tastes totally different. Like a blackened Creole seasoning. It's got the same coloring when it, you know, when the spices really cook and sear on there. It kind of yeah. turns the same color. I was just gonna say I don't know the difference between Creole and jerk. You know the seasoning. Yeah, so Creole doesn't have the sweet. It's just. I am spicy. so glad you were here today, Lyra. <laughs> you were schooling me. Oh man, I I have a recipe book with a great Creole seasoning. I will give you that recipe. Okay. Jimmy Buffett's sister, Lulu. I, I swear by her recipes. Really? She, she is. It's so good. Oh, I love that. So good. You know when you say Creole, you know what I think of what? Creole lady, mama will lie. <laughs> Okay, next, next, next dish in it, you need to do Creole and sing and while sing you prepare. And sing Lady yeah. Marmalade the whole mm -hmm. time. I'm going to put a lid on this because I literally it. cannot stop coughing. I feel myself talking and wanting to cough. Okay. So I'm just going to put the little lid on there. And you've turned the temperature to what, Lyra? Okay. I, I, we had it on like a medium high. Okay. But since I turned it down, now it's like a medium. Okay. Just because it's going to cook. We have plenty of time to cook this chicken. It's yes. going to be fine. You don't want to overcook it. It'll be dry. No, no. But I'm doing this just for the sheer... I need to talk. Yeah, okay. Do, yes. do you do what you got to do? I will. So, Lyra, we're going to do two things next. This calls for, now, I found this fascinating. Mm -hmm. Lyra did not find it fascinating. She says, <laughs> that's what I do. And I was like, of course you do, Lyra. It calls for, when we make these tacos, we have a little bit mm -hmm. of these cabbage underneath. You put the tortilla, a little bit yeah. of cabbage, the chicken, and then you drizzle it with a mayo jerk Spice, like yes. um, sauce, yes. if you will. I don't even call it a sauce or condiment, maybe. It's like a condiment, yeah. It's one third cup mayo with the two teaspoons of Jamaican jerk seasoning that we saved from earlier. Yes. I, that sounded crazy to me. I would have thought like salsa or something. Right. But mayo with jerk seasoning. Yeah, you. it's so great. You can do the same thing. We're talking about Creole. You can do the same thing with Creole or like uh, spices for taco, like fish tacos. I always do it oh, that way. Right. So you do the, the fish and the cabbage and then the ma spicy mayo on yes. top. I love the spice. Now that you say that, it makes sense. But when I looked mm -hmm. at it, I was thinking, Mayo and jerk seasoning, but spicy mayo, I love. You love it, and see, yeah. and, if, and if you want to do the cheater's way, if you've got some taco seasoning you're cooking with, just mm -hmm. put some of that taco seasoning in the mayo, and you're done. Oh, that's so great. So easy. Would you mind handing me that mayo? I'm gonna go yes, ahead and mix this. Yes, we're doing it. Do you want to go ahead and start cutting up some cilantro? I'm on it. And what does it call? The cilantro for? is for garnish. Okay. It calls okay. for. Well, I love cilantro, so it's like. We're just gonna go for it. Yeah, it says two tablespoons. Of cilantro leaves, roughly chopped, but I think we'll need more than two okay. tablespoons. And I'm going to put in. It says a third cup of mayo. So I'm going to do it. I have a little measuring cup. Oh goodness gracious, that is exploding everywhere. <laughs> that is <laughs> exploding. Okay, a third cup. Let me see if that. Oh goodness gracious, Jeremy. That is. <laughs> you you got the messy part. I got the. This is not oh good. Oh my goodness. Okay. Now I'm going to put this, I'm going to mix it into the um, jerk seasoning, and it said whisk together, so I have a whisk. Mm -hmm. I have a whisk. And up. then, Lyra, as soon as I whisk this, I'm going to ask you about tortilla size. I actually got two okay. different sizes of tortillas because I didn't know which one would be better. Well, we love choices, don't we? I, I'm all about the choices. Now I've got my whisk here. Okay, let me whisk this together. Oh man, that looks good though. Look at that. 
that's gonna be I actually wish really we would have saved good. more because I hope we have enough for everybody. Because you know people around here like to eat. It's true, yeah. There we go. Look at that. That's what's okay. Let me show you now these tortillas. I'm gonna start heating them up in this pan over here. I'm just gonna turn on medium. Here's what I got. Now, these are kind of small, mm -hmm. and these are for street tacos. They actually have street taco on the side. Which of these tortillas should we use for our Jamaican tacos? Do you, you have know a what? preference? If you were serving them for dinner, you could go with the bigger size. Mm -hmm. If you're doing a fun appetizer or a game day kind of thing, I would go with the street taco size. Yes. They're just perfect for holding. It'll be easiest for us today, I bet, to do the street yeah. taco. Yeah, you know what? I actually, that's actually a great idea. One hand, easier mm -hmm. to eat, and we'll dip out the proportions smaller so we have more to go around for that's all right. of our friends here at the studio. Yes. And I love my tortillas just a little bit warm, so I'm going to heat up this pan. Now, do you recommend any butter in the pan, olive oil, or do you just plop them in? I just plop them in. Okay. I'm not of course, because when you hold it, you don't want it to be all sticky. Oh, that's true. You know, yeah. but you could, you know, more butter, more better. <laughs> <laughs> that's my motto, Lyra. <laughs> mo butter, mo better. I mean, my family grew up. It's almost like that Paula Deen kind of oh, philosophy yeah. uh -huh. of just butter. And... Well, I know you always have that motto: more is more. Yes, that right? is my motto. Mo your motto is more is more. My <laughs> motto is more is more with everything in life. So I'm just going to put some tortillas in here, and hopefully this will get hot enough to. Uh, Warm them up. I so don't go anywhere. When we come back, the chicken is almost done. We're going to put them in the tortillas and we're going to rank it. We're going to ask mm. our friends to come and try it with us. More dish in it right after this.